were on what did Vince call that the talk show? Do you remember you were on? Then I found the footage of it. What was it called? Tuesday Night Titans. Tuesday Night Titans. That's what it was. Can you explain to me how that came about? And I know there's a specific story to this episode. Well, you know, I don't know if it was I don't know if it was March of of eighty five or May of eighty five. I think it was May. But in May of 85, I, came, I walked into Poughkeepsie, and Howard Finkel came walking up to me, and he went, Mario? And I went, yeah, yeah Howard. He goes, we need you to land over Maryland next Tuesday. I said, uh, to, to work? He, he's like, no, no, for Tuesday night tight. So Tuesday night tight? He went, yes, you're going on Tuesday night tight. So I said, oh, oh, okay. And I sat down and I said, it happens that fast. It happens that fast. Well, I wonder what they're going to do with me. Oh, my God, I'm, I'm getting my break. This is it. This is it. Yep. I'm going on Tuesday night Titans. Only superstars go on Tuesday night Titans. Yeah. Wow. 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 Then Pete Doherty came up to me. Hey, 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 Mario, Mario. I go, yeah, Pete. Hey, are you going to Landover next week? I go, yeah. Oh, yeah, me too. <laughs> so I go up to Rusty Brooks and I go, hey, Rusty, you going to Landover, Maryland next Tuesday? Like, yeah, you going? I'm like, uh huh. And of course Lombardi. I say, "Hey, my man Mario, you going? To, you, they, they tell you to go to Landover next week." Yeah. So I walk up to Howard Finkel and I go, "Hey Howard, what's this show about?" He goes, "The Unsung Heroes of Wrestling, the losers." <laughs> God. The Unsung Heroes of Wrestling, the losers. I went, "Oh, okay." And of course, Roma was was in on that, and uh, he was there as well, wasn't he? Yeah, I was sitting right next to him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so that that's how that came about, and and we did the show, and they actually edited it, and and now that everything's over with Lombardi, um, I've always wanted to say this, but I I would never say anything nice, but I'm going to say it now. They edited that because Steve really did a good job in trying to egg us on. And Roma and I just wouldn't catch on. He really did. You know, these guys like this who always lose their matches. They don't know what they're doing. They're, they're not as hungry as I am. And in retrospect, I should have got out of my chair and said, you know, Lombardi, you got a big mouth. You know, something could have started there, and I just didn't. I didn't do it. And they mm. edited a lot of that out. And in fact, when our segment was over, Lombardi said, was that okay? And Vince said, well, the, 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 uh, the set stayed in one piece, but yeah. And I looked, you could ask Roma. I looked at Roma. I go, if he knew, if I knew he wanted us to wreck the set, I would have gladly done it. I, yeah. So this, this, this was kind of like a, a new thing for you guys then being the TV studio. So like none of this was scripted, was it? Like what kind of pointers did you get, if any? Well, uh, none, none of it was scripted. You, you know what I mean? We just went out there and then we did that. We did that unknown comic thing and I did the rock'em sock'em robots with them. But, uh, you know, nothing was told us was to just show up and then they introduced us and then he showed he showed that clip of that kid with David Simartino banging his head. And then he asked us questions about that. Then he showed a clip with me with Bundy, you know, and they even edited that out because I had said to Vince, I said, you know, Mr. McMahon, like you always say on your, your, your um, commentary, one wrong slip and my career could skyrocket. Cause he goes, what, what, what did, what makes you sign a contract to, to wrestle a man like King Kong Bundy, Mario? Yeah. And I, I, I explained that, you know, I was 18 years old and, you know, and, 
and then I said, you know, your own commentary, you say, you know, one wrong move and, and you know, I could get a three count in my career. Cause guy, they even, they even edited that, that out too. Cause I remember saying it. Um, but yeah, I mean, if I knew, but we, we, we knew nothing. And you got to remember something, Maurice. I, I, you know, that was, that was a month before my 19th birthday. So put yourself in my shoes. You're 18 years old. You're yeah, with the biggest year, wrestling, yeah. yeah, yeah, biggest wrestling company on the planet. You know what I mean? It, you know, you can't even believe that you're there. 